się do tego. Uh, it began in 2005 when I brought uh, David, who is a graphic designer in London, uh, to Warsaw. And the first thing I noticed were the uh, old neon signs still hanging on the walls. And I suggested to Alona, who is a photographer, that she should set about documenting the neon signs. So it, it all started with uh, Neon Berlin, uh, which was still hanging near Plaza Zbawiciela. Uh, when I went to photograph it, it was gone, um, which really surprised me because it's been there for 40, 50 years. Um, so I found out what happened with it. It was meant to be thrown for scrap metal. And uh, we decided then uh, to start collecting, uh, not only photographing the neons. Wszystko zaczęło się od wystawy w Londynie, potem ta wystawa wróciła do Warszawy, do Pałacu Kultury i wtedy rozpoczęła się taka debata o neonach, które jeszcze pozostały na ulicach warszawskich i takie zainteresowanie neonami. Rezultatem tego zainteresowania był, wydaje mi się, mój album Warszawa Polski Neon i, i potem drugi album Polish Cold War Neon, który został wydany w Nowym Jorku kilka miesięcy temu. Także to zainteresowanie neonami wydaje mi się, że wychodzi poza Polskę już. To jest tak jakby kontynuacja polskiej grafiki, bo osoby, które projektowały te neony, projektowały też, byli po prostu grafikami, projektowali plakaty, neony byli architektami. Na samej, na otwarciu muzeum 19 maja było nas ponad 10 tysięcy osób. No to samo w sobie mówi, że takie muzeum jest potrzebne I, i ludzie się jakoś z niego cieszą i jest inne. To jest jedyne w Polsce i pewnie nawet w Europie muzeum neonu. Uh, from the conversations I have with our visitors, I sense there's um, a great interest in not just the, the neon as a piece of design, as something beautiful to look at, but also um, the history and the fascinating story of Polish neon during the 60s and 70s when most of the cities uh, in Poland were neonized. And um, this added story really, really creates uh, excitement in our in our visitors. Uh, 
Uh, when I'm asked what my favourite neon is, um, I have to say Yashi, Yashimogo Shikariyanyo. Uh, from a typo typographic perspective, uh, it's fascinating. You have the script font with the slab serif, um, Kaviyanya, and it's such, such a fascinating neon sign which once adorned uh, a cult iconic coffee shop in the 1970s on uh, Yan Pavwa in Warsaw. Uh, and really it is quite remarkable. We raised uh, funds for its renovation fairly recently at the Drukhania in, in Warsaw, where thousands of people came and donated and we had a party, uh, Vanda Ibanda played, and it was, it was a great uh, public um, party. And it got a lot of interest in the forthcoming museum and um, here we have it on the wall, and it really is beautiful. <laughs>